Hey guys, and welcome back to SCL TV Live. Now joining me in the studio is spoken word artist extraordinaire, Jackie Hill. Hey Jackie. How you doing? <laughs> Thanks for coming. Yeah. I, it's so great to have you here. I've seen some of your work and I'm like, this girl is dope. Dot net dot org dot com. Dot everything. Dot everything. Yeah. Um, so how did you get started in, in writing poetry? Um, I initially just was in class at Forest Park and I was extremely bored. Mm -hmm. And so I just wrote a poem because I had nothing else to do. And then it happened to be good, I guess. So then I put it on Facebook and then I just kept writing and then you know, hooked up with this ministry called P4CM in LA. My poem got popular and I was like, oh, okay, I can straight do something with this for the glory of God. So yeah. that's honestly how I started. So like, all of your poetry is Christian based. Yes. And can you talk a little bit about that? How how you got started in that? And what is P, P what is it? P, P4CM. P4CM. Yeah. Um, I was, I became a Christian like uh, October 2008. Mm -hmm. I wrote my first, first poem, October, no, January 2009. Mm -hmm. And I mean, I didn't know what else to talk about but the Lord, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Um, because I see my poetry as a gift from him to glorify him. Mm -hmm. And so it's like, there's no point in me talking about golf, okay. you know, and golf can't save anybody, <laughs> you know? So I, I just talk about my struggles, my temptations, what I may see in the body of, the Christ, body of Christ, what I may see in unbelievers' lives. Like, mm -hmm. I just really, my poetry is just up pulpit really mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying i think i'm just teaching and preaching sermons through poetry through poetry yeah that's all i'm doing now i've seen you how do you memorize like um your I poems are maybe 10 minutes long how do you memorize everything I, that you I do i say them over and over and over and over and over uh -huh. again till i get it honestly like my my uh poem a poem about we i practiced it an hour to two hours a day for two sh two weeks straight wow so by the time i got on stage i knew it you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. like i knew it by heart by heart and that's kind of now nice. you just mentioned that poem of about we right. about marijuana i don't know if, can we say we marijuana <laughs> yeah now um talk a little bit about that poem and we'll talk about how far it went you were just yeah. You were just on a popular website yeah. in regards to that poem. Tell us a little bit about what that poem's about. Um, it's basically me playing two personalities about someone who loves weed or like I'm playing Mary Jane, but I'm trying to play it from like an antagonistic part where it's like I'm the person that loves weed and then I'm the person that like doesn't love weed or whatever. Mm -hmm. And it was just a means of really showing and exposing the idolatry of weed, not just the plant itself, but how much people esteem it over God. Mm -hmm. That's really the whole point of the poem. And because of the two personality, the whole Jekyll and Hyde swag, that's what mm -hmm. made it like popular. Right. So yeah. So it was just featured on World Star Hip Hop, right. which is a, a popular secular hip hop. Right. How did that? How did you know it was on there? How did you? Um, I got happened? a tweet, and mm -hmm. somebody was like, "Sis," because it was on 420 National like Get High Day or whatever. Mm -hmm. And somebody tweeted me, was like, "Sis, your poem is on World Star," and I just started laughing. Mm -hmm. And <laughs> went on World Star and saw it, and it was like 13,000 views in like an hour. Wow. And then um, it just blew up from there. From there. Yeah. Wow, and what's it been like since after that? Have you been getting any tweets, calls? Or? Um, I've got a whole nother crowd that mm -hmm. knows me now. Before it was just all Christians, but mm -hmm. now it's a lot of people that aren't necessarily Christians that follow me on Twitter, on Facebook, that are being introduced to my poems that's been mm -hmm. out two, three years. Cause a poem about weed came out a year ago, but a lot of people think it's new, mm -hmm. you know? So it's it's been dope. Cause that's the arena I want to go into is, you know, not Christian arena, mm -hmm. so. Yeah. Now, are you, like, you do your portrait, and when you're on stage, you turn to this, like, whole other person, but now yeah. you're just kind of, like, not so lot, chill, yeah. whatever. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what gives you the energy to do that? Um, I enjoy it. Mm -hmm. I think that's what, like, when I'm on stage, I can just, like, go off. Mm -hmm. Like, that's what I call it. I could just spaz out through some poetry in a way because it's not even really my personality. Like, I'm mm -hmm. real low-key and calm and introverted and all that. So it's just... It's something I'd like to do. And then people are more willing to listen you listen to you when they can tell that you care. Mm -hmm. You know, if I'm doing a poem that I care nothing about, it's going to be obvious in my delivery. Right. So I think that's why. Yeah. That's so awesome. You guys, we got some more um, information on Jackie. Her, her Facebook is right there and her Twitter is also on the screen. If you want to find out more information about her, she's on JackieHill.com. She also has a great DVD that's out. We're going to talk more about that when we get back. You guys don't want to go anywhere right after this. We'll be right back.
To keep up with more and STL TV and all the great events going on around St. Louis, you got to friend us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can always catch us streaming live at stltv.net. Before we go take a break, take, check out today's hot feature job brought to you by Slate and Missouri Career Stores. Keep it locked right here on STL TV. We'll be right back with more.